So the next exercise is not even an exercise. We are just going to, to see how we can solve challenges that are classified as reversing without any reversing at all. I hope you try to do it yourself before uh, looking th through this walkthrough. The solution um, is here. We have like the skeleton as always. Uh, you can have your reverse engineering workflow here, like I, I had before, like I would use the fire and then the path to my binary. And this one is in the A. And the name of our binary is Tokyo Westerns and a hash. If we look uh, this binary, it's again a nail. 32 bit. Uh, so let's try to solve this challenge without even looking into the binary. We are going to import anger and then we create a project with anger project and then the path. It's good to start having the load options always set to the auto load lips false. Uh, not that it's completely necessary in this case, but it's uh, a good practice if you are going to use it to create control flow graphs. So I always have in this kind of template. So let's set it false. And then we can create a simulation. Let's do project factory and then the scene group. Next we explore. And what we want to find this time is again the lambda function that we uh, always have, but let's try something just a little bit uh, different. I will use the strings because the strings is not real reversing and we exercises a and talk if we look into the strings here, uh, we can see that there is this have, have, have from reversing probably, and then you get the input. And depending on what we uh, input here, probably we have the same as password okay and password wrong. We have input error and correct. So let's try to find the path that leads us to correct. And that's what we are going to do. We create an exploration and our find uh, value in this case is again a lambda function that it's looking for a string and our string in this case is correct. And this should be in the POSIX stamps. And this is not what we are like, it's not the input that we need, it's that uh, we need this to be on the after. So this is how we look. And Anger is going to try to find it. Still running. And we actually have a, an active path. Two times it dead ended. But we have a found. So let's check what it's in the found. As we remember, we can check what it's in the found, like getting all the paths that we have there. We look into the found, we have one, so that's index zero. We look into the POSIX 
Exams. Let's just check what it's in the one. And we actually have the correct. So let's see what was the input for it. And the, you can see that the flag is here. The FF byte and then we have the flags. So let's store this in our flag. We can do this just um, turning it into a um, string. And then we need to remove the bytes in the beginning and in the end. And let's hope it works. There you go. So here we have the flag.